Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspies. We're doing a 10 buck break from 10 buck breaks.com. 2017 Panini Prism Football. It's a one box random team break number eight. 10 buck breaks.com. There's all the folks involved. We're going to double up this list like Sir Mix a Lot. One spot gets you two teams. And all the teams are in, of course. Let's randomize each list three times. One and a two. Three times. One, two, and three. Easy. Easy. Devin on the poll, uh, and Manuel in the number 32 spot. Oh, no, I don't want to search those names, Google. I wanted to copy them. There we go. Uh, one and a two, three times for the teams. One, two, and three. All right, we got the Jets on top and the Giants on the bottom. All right, so here we go. Devin with New York Jets, Jets, Jets. Bruce with the Chiefs. Karen with the Cardinals. Chris with the Browns. Devin with the Falcons. Danny with the Eagles. Chris with the Broncos. Aaron, you got the Raiders. Nice. Daniel Art, last spot mojo. Uh, Lions. Karen with the Panthers. Joe Cavanaugh with the Dolphins. Alfonso uh, with the Saints and the Buccaneers. Joe Cavanaugh with the Redskins. Daniel Art with your other last spot mojo. Tennessee Titans. Danny with the Jaguars. Paul with the Rams, Aaron with the Seahawks, Chris with the Bears, Bruce with the Steelers, Bruce with the Cowboys, Manuel with the Patriots, Michael Gallucci with the Texans, Bruce with the Colts, Danny with the Bills, Joe with the uh, Vikings, Chris with the Packers, Paul with the Bengals, Danny with the Niners, Michael with the Chargers, Joe Cavanaugh with the Ravens, and Manuel with the New York Football Giants. Any trades? Let's organize, sort these by team. I think there's usually a lot of trades that happen in these one box breaks. All right. Uh, Joe Cavanaugh says Vikings for Jaguars. Anyone's interested in that? If Danny's interested in that, uh, DC's asking for products like, oh, like reg, like standard size top loaders. You know what? I don't know. We just use from Ultra Pro. We just use these, the three by four regular top loader. I don't know what point size it would technically be, but that's the ones we use for standard size, uh, standard size cards. I think. 35, right? Pretty sure. 55 is a little too is a little too loose. The card is a little too loose in there for standard sizes anyway. All right. If um, yeah, I don't think there's any trades. <clears throat> so TWC trade window closed. All right. So that list, hot off the presses, remains the same. The song remains the same. The list remains the same. There it is, a nice clean printout. Here is the one box from the break. And good luck, folks. Three autographs is what we're looking for in case you forgot. Pop all these guys open. Good luck, everybody. Thank you for getting in. We've got a, uh, uh, we've got plenty more. So we'll, we'll post another one box break uh, right after this. This break should only take about five minutes or so. Crazy weekend of football, boys and girls. Crazy times. Uh, for some reason, 
Uh, AJ Green, I guess, didn't get suspended, but Mike Evans did get suspended. I'm pretty sure Mike Evans should have been suspended, and he did. I'm pretty sure that AJ Green should have been suspended for at least a game, too, but didn't. I don't know why, and it just didn't make sense to me. So I don't know what Roger Goodell is doing, but kind of mucking it up as usual. Uh, there's Kareem Hunt. Nice Kareem Hunt. Sweet Kareems are made of these for Bruce. Bruce Chang and the Chiefs. Nice. Oh, I see. So there's you're saying that because Green got ejected, so no suspension, and Evans did. All right. There's Stacy Coley for the Vikings at a two seventy five. And another Chief, Jehu Chesson. Nice blue wave. 21 out of 149. Well, now that's just confusing. Why didn't Evans get ejected? <laughs> All right, there's Terrell Pryor Sr., not having a good season for him. A lot of people who drafted him in fantasy probably disappointed. Uh, did you guys see? I was just I was very confused about Jameis Winston eating W's. Did you guys see that? He was eating W's, I guess, to try to pump his pump up his team. I think he got kind of blank looks there. He should fire his joke writers, speech writers. Chad Hansen for the Jets. Devin with that one for the Jets, Jets, Jets. So those are your three autographs there. There's Jamal Adams. Yeah, worst pregame speech ever, says ESPN Kids, is Ryan. Nice one for the Jets. Green scope on that one. That would be uh, Devin. I just, I watched that and I was just like, <laughs> you could see the guys around him, you know, like, sure, listen, you, 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 you can try to do whatever shtick you want to do. Anybody can, you know, can do that. That's fine. But <laughs> it's clearly something that he, uh, I guess, decided to do for the first time. So it wasn't like even an inside joke. You look at the guys standing around him, they're all just like, what are you doing? Ryan Tannehill out of 149 for the Dolphins. My Raiders beating the Dolphins. Weird season for the Raiders, too. Christian McCaffrey. I suppose you're going to start seeing him get a lot of work in now that Kelvin Benjamin is gone. That goes to the Panthers. That'll be for Karen. There's Kenny Britt for the Browns. Out of one ninety nine, we'll sleeve and top load all of those, uh, all those parallels as well. And the last bit, nice fun little one box break from tenbugbreaks.com. There's Marquise Goodwin to two seventy five. So join us next time for more talk football, talk fantasy sports. Bust open some boxes. There's Trevor Simeon, and have some fun. So thanks very much. Another ten bug break in the books. We'll see you next time on 10bugbreaks.com. Bye-bye.